Hello, everyone! Let's bring out my beloved folding chair and see how we do in Star Trek Bridge Crew. So, yeah, if you're unfamiliar with Star Trek Bridge Crew, it is a VR game that just came out where you get to be on the bridge of a starship. Star Trek. Usually the USS Aegis, but they do have the original Enterprise in there, which is sort of a hard mode because the interface is a convoluted mess. Although I am confident enough in my engineering skills that I will gladly do that. And yeah, I will... Since I will be in VR, I will not be able to respond to the chat, so apologies on that. But this should prove to be entertaining, because yes, you play it four-player online with a crew. And I just got me some fine new headphones. Let's make sure I'm... Okay, I'm putting them on the right way. Bridge crew. Be a little tricky to get these on. <laughs> Dang it, I wanted to use these headphones. They're so good. They're arguably too good. Come on, come on. Work with me here. Work with me. Don't break. Ah, Dang. Dang, 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 darn it, dang. I, I got Dragon Quest slime headphones, <laughs> but they're not wide enough. <laughs> To be used with a VR headset. Okay. Oh, good. And someone from last night's crew is on there. Because I did... I played a little bit and got into a fantastic crew. And it was pretty wonderful. But I need to... Sorry for the slow start, everyone. But I'm gonna need some kind of headphones. So I can hear people without them hearing a teve. Because communication in this game is important. Very, very important. So. Let's plug this thing in. These are the earbuds that actually come with your PlayStation VR. Yeah, it does not come with the nice uh, headphones that are advertised. Now, does it? But these are okay. Like, in the realm of earbuds, these are some of the better earbuds I've used. Now then. On to the bridge crew. Let's rotate these around properly and get in there. Yeah. And so it begins. Sure, there are no obstacles. <laughs> yeah, that's a view you don't actually want to see. But okay, <laughs> this, is, this is what the room looks like. Oh boy, we're all clear. This is all clear. This is what all clear looks like. Shut up! I need to clean this room really badly. Unfortunately, since this game is made by Ubisoft, you cannot play, uh, you cannot play offline at all. Like, as a single player, but you need an internet connection. Don't need PS Plus for the single player, but you need an internet connection. Because, of course, because Ubisoft. Going to dislike them, just a smidge, but Red Storm is pretty cool, because they know how to do, uh, multi-platform online VR hijinks. Lean forward a little bit. And then... Good. Good, good, good. Everything is on the right hands. Get these on here so that way the little tassels aren't annoying me. And, uh... 
Where are my friends? Where are my friends is at? Rackham. Let's see what happens. Hey! Hey! And Seymour! Excellent! Dude. Engineer, let's go! Oh, yes! Yeah. Alright, we're the best about to do engineer in the fleet, man. Yup! We, we got it. Alright, I guess I'm captain today. Oh, jeez, this mission you again! You got this. What mission should we do? Let's do three, that's where we ended last night. Alright, cool. Everybody down with that? I'm down with that! Yep. Let's do right, it. Launching. Jill, as always, love your enthusiasm. <laughs> it's what I do! Times are a little long. Link log start date 2258.206. It's become clear that the dangers of the trench make it unsuitable for a population as fragile as the Vulcans. The Federation will have to find a new home for the Vulcan people elsewhere. After our encounter with Klingon warships, our mission has changed. We need to know what the Klingon Empire is up to. We've detected significant Klingon activity deep within the trench. We're going in alone to see what we can learn. All right, let's do it. This is going to be the ultimate test for me. We will have to be cautious. Based on my data, I believe the Klingon. Nice to see you in that chair, Rakim. Ah, oh, it's been a long time coming. Jill. Yes. P. You're the man. All right. Or woman. Whatever you want. <laughs> whatever to be. I want to be. Alright, infiltrate the Klingon network. So, let's go ahead and get a warp going uh, to the Arna system. Uh, can you do that for me, Helm? Gotcha. Charging coils? Alright. Thank you very much. Don't even have to be axed. That's what I love. We have a civilian ship. Warp coils charged. We don't know about them. You can scan blow if you them want up. Fun. All right, punch it. Whoa! <laughs> All right. Oh, that's a lot of debris. Right, let's take a look at these objectives here. All right. Yeah, it does seem to be a lot. Tell me let's get my job. Map. All right. Looks like we got a search area ahead of us, about 88 kilometers forward. Um, let's go ahead. So one thing I want to go ahead and do, we need to avoid detection. So Seymour, do a, do me a favor and go ahead and, and disarm any missiles you may have. Try and reduce that. Uh, They're all disarmed. Reduce that Perfect. Excellent. Um, let's go ahead and start heading towards that area. So engineer, I'm going to need a little more power to the engines. Done. And uh, yeah, just keep an eye out, Seymour, on when you can go ahead and send out a scan. Uh, let's start moving Will forward. Do. Looks like we're pretty we're clear of any environmentalists. Uh, uh, they're just debris. Looks, yeah, it looks like they'd be debris and derelict ships. We don't need to worry about them at the moment. Alright, hull seems to be at 100%. Don't need to worry about their shields. We do have an anomaly ahead. I think we can stay, cl stay clear of that, though. Would you like me to scan it? Uh, uh, if you can, go ahead. On that. Yeah, I was gonna say if you're in range. Um, yeah, once you get in range, go ahead and scan that. That could be a location. Will do. Oh, uh, we got two ahead of us, so you're gonna have to anyway. All right, I'll scan the one that's closest to us, going towards the uh, objective. Uh -oh. All right, sounds good. Cloak and vessel What's coming up? in. All 
Nope, there's a vessel. It's bird right, prey that's scout. It's just right, patrolling. It's all right, so we need to remain undetectable. So, Helm, I'm gonna go ahead and ask you to kind of back us up a little bit. Maybe try and get us around that hazard. Picking up some localized signals, Captain. They're consistent with a Klingon sensor network node. Ooh. If we can access a node without triggering it, we may be able to inject an override. It could give us more time to work in the system undetected. We might be able to. Hold on, let me see. All right, so we might want to try and get a little closer to that Klingon sensor. So let's go ahead and maybe just approach very slightly towards uh, towards that. Hostile ship is fleeing. How are we looking on that anomaly? Uh, still not able to scan yet. Thirty right, clicks go ahead out. And go ahead and raise shields. Oh, I can scan uh, now if you like. All right, go ahead. Raising shields and scanning. Minimal range shield take a little bit. Oh, watch that debris. <laughs> try. Doing a fine job, Helm. Uh, I always get nervous if I click the outside view. <laughs> I know, right? Oh, it's harmless. Alright, right, so let's slowly take let's slowly take approach. Engineer, go ahead and remove some power to shields. Uh, and we're gonna take a slow approach towards this uh, this the scan area. Alright, right power to shields. Actually, go ahead and do me a favor and take one of those little, take one of those nodes and move it to the phaser, just in case this gets hostile. Good call. We're all right. We're all right with the anomaly. It's harmless. I want to keep an eye on this. The second you can scan that sensor, go ahead and do it. And we'll come to a full stop. We'll have to be patient. All righty. Should be. Usually, it gets to about 30 clicks in. As you come to a full stop. We want to reduce our sensors, so go ahead and disarm our torpedoes if they are armed. Cool. And I'm go ahead and pull this up. Okay. Not yet, I'm not ready on skin. Torpedoes disarm. Uh, shit, I think we need we need to avoid detection as best as possible. So I'm thinking maybe we do need to lower the shields, or if we reduce power, does that lower our detection radius? Uh, it should, yes. Um. Alright, go ahead and reduce power to shields. How much? Uh, go ahead. Uh, let's see. Reduce it one more. Uh, yeah, we should be okay. Let's see if we can get a little bit closer. I'll let you know when to stop helm. I just, uh, we're detectable at 19.9 kilometers, so we can get closer. Yeah, I'm out of range on skins. All right, there you go. Let's see how right, we do. Motivation, everybody, do a quick dab, real quick. I like that, good job. Kept us all. Except for the helm, he's there. <laughs> there. He's driving. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Keep your hands on the wheel, man. No dabbing while driving. <laughs> this is gonna be new billboards out. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. See it on the road. No, no dabbing while driving. Helm All about right, another so ten kilometers, and then come to a full stop, and then we'll see what we do. From I'm there. in minimal scan range. All right, go ahead and start scanning. And then. Starting to scan. You want me to turn off shields or keep them on? Turn off shields, Helm. Come to a full stop. Shields full have been stop. lowered. Excellent. Helm, go at half speed. Actually, no, we're made at full stop. I apologize. All right, this is this communication sensor. All right, let's go ahead and disrupt their communications. All righty. Disrupting communications. That should keep us from showing up on the sensor network for now. Excellent. We're picking up additional network nodes around the system, Captain. Each one we disrupt might buy us a little more time to operate. Uh, I heard. Alright, let's go ahead and investigate the boneyard in Arna. I think we are in Arna, aren't we? Yeah, we are. Hold on. Maybe an impulse? 
That's what I'm checking right now. Sorry, I got fat fingers. Here we go. Go ahead and impulse to go ahead and impulse to asteroid field. No, take it back. Go ahead and impulse to the boneyard. Let's get that out of the way. Graveyard? Yes, uh, yes. Ben, it's, it says boneyard, yeah, graveyard, that's it. Yeah, okay. I hate when it does this when like, the VR not only moves my head, but like the whole screen in front of me. Oh yeah, I gotcha. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. I know that feeling. Are we prepared for impulse, engineer? Uh, yeah. Should be good. We've got full power excellent. to engine. Engi yeah, and excellent. Glad to hear that. Love it. Fucking love it. I love that you're jetted. silent and the few times we talk to you, you get so excited. <laughs> Oh, you can hear nothing from me, and then yep, yep, we're doing Darn it. Darn right! Go ahead, I love prepared. it, man. You, you keep the team going. Ah, uh, will do. All right, tactical. The second we come out of impulse, I'm gonna need you to raise those shields for me, just in case. Looks like we might have possible enemy war vessels in the area. Ready to raise. Whoa. Oh, raising now. Activating in nine seconds. One million million torpedoes. Two enemy here. ships. One civilian. Ready arms to torpedoes on your mark. On, on uh, ten, one moment. Alrighty. Well, it doesn't seem like we might have it. Uh, let's see. All right, so actually, let's. Can any possible chance you can scan that uh, civilian ship? I am out of range for now. All right, go ahead and disarm. Go ahead and go ahead. Do you have torpedoes armed? Uh, I can't arm them. They're all disarmed right now. Don't do that right now. Uh, actually, uh, go ahead and go ahead and reduce power to shield level by two. Oh, still level. There you go. All right, let's slowly approach towards the civilian vessel. We're detectable at 19.9 kilometers once again, so we'll try and keep that as it is. I think we should be close to getting. Detect uh, to be able to scan that civilian ship. My map just changed. All right, it's back. Yeah. No need to worry about that anomaly at the moment, unless another one pops up, just like that. If you can scan that anomaly, go ahead. Um, I'm having trouble clicking on just you know. There it is. Uh, it's out of range. No worries. Oh, the one closest is in range. I can scan that one. Go ahead and scan any anomalies you can. Scanning the one on the left. And the result is hazardous. Alright, uh, so we'll want to avoid that one. I would imagine the one on the right is hazardous as well. Keep an eye out on that tra transport ship. The anomaly on the right is hazardous as well. Excellent. Alright, so. Trying to weave we between them. No, you're doing a fine job. Uh, let's see. The second you can scan that transport ship, go ahead. We're still not detectable for another 10 kilometers. All right, I can scan it. All right, begin scanning, and then at about 22 kilom at about 24 kilometers, come to a full stop, Helm. Okay. Shield on the right, so I suppose I just popped up a shield. Warning: Environmental hazard detected. Ooh. Full stop, it stop. Full stop, Helm. It just stopped my scan for some reason. Because of the or normal. Uh, should we stop uh, in this thing? Yep. Our shield um, is taking damage, minor, but it's taking some. Alright, go ahead and raise power to shields. Raising power to shields. Uh, no oh, chance of scanning. All the anomalies. Still uh, no chance of scanning inside the anomaly. Raise full power to shields, let's get a little closer to that, that transport ship. Start moving in. Alright, Helm, start moving in slowly. Yep. Shields are 89 percent. All right, we can get a little closer without being detected as well. Uh, once you get the 15 All kilometers, right, scan range again. All right, once you get the 15 kilometers, go ahead and come to a full stop for me, Helm. Will do. Scan is moving extremely slow. No worries. Uh, it says uh, the environment is causing some hull damage, although the shields are preventing that, and our sensors are reduced. Shields are 86 percent and lowering slowly. 
Uh, oh, shit. Gains are missing. All right. Raise shields to full power. Uh, drag, add power to phasers. Scan complete. When we start attacking. Oh, yes. Open. Start open fire on that Klingon vessel. Ship on the right side, so, uh, left side, so attack sh now. Yep. Shields are at 16%, continue to open fire. Don't worry about the ship on the Opening left. Fire. They're about to disrupt their support. shields. Alright, I'm going to attack their shields. Alright, concentrate Probably on the vessel to the left. That ship concentrate on no the vessel anymore. to the left. Alright. Yes, sir. Sensors are showing waypoints consistent with recent cloaking activity. Torpedoes are armed. Excellent. All right. Target destroyed. Excellent job. We have another approaching. I'm gonna attack this ship in front of our shields real quick when the beam powers up. This out of range. Right. Helm, Helm, do me a favor. Turn back around. Let's go try and see what we can do for that ship. All right. I can start trying to just void that call. Void that call. Let's concentrate on taking out this warship. All right. They're turning. They're turning around a lot sooner than I expected. Shields are at forty percent. How are we looking? Let's go ahead. Can we take now? We can't take one power. Let's transfer some of that power to the phasers from the shield. Done and done. Phasers are at maximum power. All right. Light those bastards up. Shield strength is at zero. Oh, uh, man. Excellent. Target destroyed. Let's go ahead and take out that bird of prey scout to the left. Working on it. Uh, the torpedoes are raising. Engineer, let's get some repairs going. I'm right working now. on it. Shields are completely down. Well, torpedoes are loading in. Oh, jeez. They're just... Hitting our warp oh, cores yeah, really right. bad. I know, they are tearing us apart. That man, that motherfucker's got some serious shields on them. You're scanning that bastard? I already did. I'm attacking their shields. Oh, jeez, our. Excellent. Helm, let's get this ship turned around. Our hull's at 55%. Yeah, boy, is it. I cannot imagine this being the last of it. Alright, Tactical, let's continue opening fire. Warning. Torpedoes are loading now. Very nice. <laughs> Torpedoes are halfway loaded. Very nice. Our shields are reloading. Our, sh our shields are almost right, down again. Couple shields are down. Shields are down. Yeah. Yes, they are. Torpedoes are most loaded in three, two, one. Open fire. Loaded. That should take him out. Target oh, yeah, destroyed. Target destroyed. All right, engineer, let's get these repairs. I'm going working on it. Get us closer to our target. On the way. I can try to start transporting the people. Tato, go ahead and start transporting as we get closer to the ship. Let's try and get this shit over with. How many, uh, how many, how many life forms do we have on the ship? There are only six. six. One scan should do the job yeah. just fine. All right, home, come to a complete stop. Full stop. How's the ship looking over there, Joe? Oh, uh, let's see. Our scanners are at eighty-six percent. Torpedoes are at eighty-three. Warp core is at 96, phaser is 93, engine is 94, shield emitter is 97. We're doing okay. Yeah, All I right. think we need, yeah, we need to hang tight. Uh, okay, let's see. We need to destroy that transport ship, an unstable pro protomatic core. So go ahead and do me a favor, Helm. Go ahead and get us out of the range. Uh, let's say, start doing a reverse. Once we're at a certain range, I'm going to want to open fire on that ship. We need to destroy it. We'll do. Be happy to blow it up. 
All right, shields are back at 100%. Hey, uh, Joe, go ahead and raise my shield power up to about three notches. Will do. Oh, excellent. Well, it's at four. Enjoy. <laughs> I like it. As long as we have a good amount of power to the phasers in the engine, that's fine. All right, almost there, Helm. I'll let you know. Sounds good. All right, come to a full stop. Seymour, open fire on that ship. All right, let's get us the hell out of here. Let's impulse. Torpedo launchers are confirmed that the programmer core was destroyed in the blast. Impulse to rift temperance wreckage. We have a clean on ship coming. Want me attack? No, let's try and warp out of here. I mean, impulse out of here. Impulse to rift tempest wreckage. Excellent. Are we ready to go? Now. Yes, sir. Doing good. Shields are eighty-five percent. Crank it. Made out with shields at sixty-eight. Wow. That was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we got some damage over there. I feel like, I feel like it's only going to get worse, but that's all right. Yeah, that roof kind of doesn't look safe for Spock over there. No, no, no. Yeah, I'll be fine. Hey, but at least the fire is out. The fire is out. And the got some wiring here, you know. A probe should be able to keep an eye on what's going on. Oh, we got two Klingon ships back there. Two ships. Go ahead and reduce the signal. Want me to power down torpedoes so they can't see us as well? Power down torpedoes. Torpedoes are powered down. Shield is active, right. but at 68%. Alright, we're detectable at 20 kilometers, so keep an eye on that for me, Helm. Uh, let's go ahead and... Search for the concealed location to hide a probe. Go ahead and scan. Let's go ahead and move towards that anomaly and do me a favor and scan that anomaly. That might be a safe zone for us. We'll do. Not in range just yet. No worries. <clears throat> that was not easy. <clears throat> oh, shields are back up at a hundred. Yeah, that is good news. All right, I'm in scan range. All right, go ahead and scan. Let's just keep moving towards it. Don't get too close. Halfway there. Alright. Uh, hazardous. Stay away from that. Alright, so we're going to want to avoid that at all powers. Motherfucker. Alright. Okay, I can scan uh, Alpha 2, the other ship. Alright, go ahead and start scanning. Alright, never mind, I just went out of range. I can get you a little bit. Yeah, go ahead and get us a little bit closer. We're detectable at 19.9 kilometers. Do keep that into consideration. Alright. Oh, wow. If you look at the outside of our ship, we got some holes in it. <laughs> go ahead and From take shields down shots. at the moment. Shields being lowered. There we go. Much, much better. Much better. Just let me know when you're Alpha. in scanning range. Alpha one is getting closer. I suggest we switch to the scan with him. Uh, focusing on him when we're he's moving towards us, but I'm not in range just yet. Warning: environmental hazard. Yeah, that's a big old environmental hazard. Um, yeah, we're gonna clip that. Oh, oh, oh! There it goes. All right. Hurt our ship at all? Oh. Uh, no, we're. I think we're okay. Shields are down, but that's we're not gonna scan ship. Alpha One. Go ahead and bring us into a reverse, there, Helm. This is a super slow scan, but I'm scanning Alpha One. Yeah, he's moving towards us. He's almost within. Apparently, 20. we've got power surge going on, but I don't know what that means. I'm the best engineer. That's. No, that's all right. <laughs> I went to public Starfleet Academy. <laughs> <laughs> Warning. 
All right, he's closing in. He's at he's at 20 kilometers. Well, 21. I'm scanning the most of on him. Prepare uh, our race shields. Race shields. We're gonna race fight. We're gonna fight this fucker. Ten seconds of shields. Race power to race power to phasers from the engine power. Doing it. All right, ready to attack. On your open fire. Opening fire. Oh wow, we've got three of them. Oh balls. I'm pretty certain that big thing in front of us is getting in the way of our phasers, too. They may be. I'm not getting any damage on them. Alright, I'm gonna work around them then. I gotta move. Try and work around it. Wow, I didn't think that would actually make a difference. Near Continue to open fire. Sneak it up behind us. They're bound to open fire. Uh, looking for torpe torpedoes already. Our torpedoes. We've got a scout ahead of us. He's right below us. I'm gonna try and drop us in. He's coming in behind us. Keep I'll heading forward. Someone behind us, the torpedoes. Keep heading forward there, helm. Gonna bring us about. All right. Let's get the fuck out get of forward. here. Hold on. No, we're gonna get out of here. All right. Shield strength is at. Oh my goodness, 37 percent all of a sudden. It was at 71 a second ago. Go ahead and take us. Go ahead and take Good. us back to go ahead and take us back to the asteroid field. Uh, graveyard asteroid field. Impulse. Engineer prepares for I'm impulse. I'm preparing for impulse. Full power to engines. I've almost Excellent. destroyed one of the ships. Reinforcements are on the way. We gotta get out of here. Reinforcements. I yep. need more. Here we go. I need more power to the engines. We're good. We're good. Go ahead. We're good. All right. Yep. And it looks like we had a power surge there just before we impulsed, and that's what dropped it down a little bit. That's all right. It'll reload. It'll recharge. This is stressful. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't like it. All right. Here we are in the other asteroid. That's an unfortunately familiar-looking planet. Alright, so, we, so they're just, what was that? We've been here before, so we can actually... We have a bad history we, of that planet. Uh, I can't remember the name of it, but I know that is a planet dumb things happen on. Hey, let's uh, head towards that Klingon sensor. Maybe we can scan it. We haven't been here uh, before? We have. So isn't that what we already did? Yeah, we've been here before. Uh, tactical, go ahead and keep an eye on that anomaly to our right... Looking at it. If I remember, if I remember correctly, it was harmless. Scanning. All right, go ahead. Scanning. Halfway done. And hazardous, actually. Uh, engineer, go ahead and real quick. go ahead and raise shields from the engine power. Okay. Warning. Environmental hazard detected. Let's just head that way. As of right now, we're in good hands. Uh, shut up, one. Don't tell us how to do our jobs. <laughs> Apparently we had a power exactly. surge somewhere, but I'm not seeing it anywhere on my console. No worries. We're looking good to me. You can scan that Klingon sensor there. Uh, looking. Warnings. <sighs> Should be getting close to scanning range now. I am in minimal scan now. Start heading that way. That's not good. Let's get there. That's all that matters. Scanning's almost there, halfway. Captain, the Klingons are calling for reinforcements. I don't give a shit. Alright, I got communications. Alright. You want me to disrupt them? Go ahead, disrupt communications. Disrupting communications. 
That means we can't go reinforcements, I think. I don't have any further instructions in regards to this. Um, alright. I'll take him down. Two enemy ships in the system. Alright, go ahead and head towards that for, for uh, Scout 4. Engineer, raise power to phasers. Raising power to phasers! One in front of us is almost dead. Excellent. Yeah, target 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 destroyed. destroyed. Bringing it back to the next target. Go ahead and head to Scout 5. Let's go ahead and take that guy out as well. Torpedoes are almost done. Shields are at 40%. Alright. Alright. We only have 8 torpedoes left. Yeah, let's be scarce on them. Let's try. Let's see if we can take them out with just phasers. We'll do. There you go. destroyed. Excellent. Let's start heading towards that Klingon sensor as fast as possible. Engineer, raise power to engines. Raising power to engines. All right, Helm, go ahead and bring us in. Warp core restored. All right, go ahead and disrupt the... Let's see. All right, go ahead and disrupt that sensor. The communications? Oh, it's communications, I'm sorry. It's good. Uh, disrupting now. Communications disrupt. They'll be back up in 30 seconds or recalibrating in 30 seconds. Once uh, once that uh, once that is disrupted, uh, Helm impulse us to the great uh, to the ancient ship, which is in our. We're already in that region. Okay. Calculating travel vector. Let's hit it. Uh, communications just went back online for him. Moe disrupt again. Let's impulse. I'm sweating. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, punch it. Oh wow, we got a lot of ships up here. At least three enemy ships detected. Will we raise shields? Raise shields. Shields being raised. Uh, engineer, go ahead and move some power to the shields. Done and done. We don't have many torpedoes for this fight. Yeah, we're gonna. This, uh, this is probably gonna be the end of it, fellas. But you know what? We're not going out without a fight. Let's go ahead and just start approaching target. Let's All do right. it. I'm gonna pull Let's see how the anomaly fight. just a little bit. The second we can get over there, I want you to start scanning that ship. Well, dude, I'm scanning only shields so they'll load fast and I can take them out. Should be able to get a minimal scan anytime now. At some point, yeah. No, yeah, almost. I've got Delta 3 inside 30. That's the closest ship is Delta Three. He's almost there. About to come Scanners. in range. All right, he's in range. Go ahead and open fire using pulses, engineer. Yep. You're doing pulses that. Remain, ready, yeah. remain as it is. Remain as it okay. is. Okay. Shields are important right now. I'm isolating their shield frequency, and I'm about to attack it. How are we looking? We're looking fine right now. Excellent. Got the shields down to 50%. These bastards are tough. Yeah. Our shields are at 66. Their, their shields are at 25. Their shields are at 25. Start heading towards that ancient ship. Let's see if we can get a scan in there somewhere. That's what's most important right now. Whew. 
Engineer, raise power of engines. All right. So tell me when you want me to fire a torpedo. All right, we're in, we're in, we're in good shape right now. Let's focus on the guy right there by the ancient ship too. Let's start heading that way. I'm going that way now. Captain, toss out reinforcements en route. I bet they are. Oh uh, boy. They've still got their packs, so it's one of them's kind of coming about. One of, them, one of them's turning around. We're okay at the moment. Are on the way. Engineer, raise more power to engines. All right. From, from the, the shield. shield, all right. I can scan the ancient ship. All right, scan it. Scanning. It's a very long scan. That's going to oh, take crap. some time. Start, Let's just start, yeah, start moving towards him. Start moving towards it. That's all I need you to do. I can't fire on that guy while scanning. No worries. We're not firing at all. 32% shields, 20%. They should make it before the scan ends. The scan is done now. We, we should be close scan. to about Shields are down. All right. Let's go ahead and get to Rift Tempest. Prepare impulse. Prepare impulse to Rift Tempest. Head to the Cosmic Storm. Jet. Yeah, yeah, I hear. Nice. Whew. Oh, gosh. Good going, Captain. And there's a <sighs> fire behind the Captain. Good. Fuck it. <laughs> Let it burn. Oh, we got fire up there, too. Good, good. Someone get some marshmallows. All right. We didn't start the fire. Oh crap! They just don't like us. Reduce you. Uh, fuck it. Shields are down, down right completely. Let's start heading towards that vessel. Let's try and take the same approach. It's gonna be a close one. Whoa! Oh well, my screen just showed him like all around us. Oh, he's coming in fast. Yeah, he is. What the hell was oh, that? Oh, they just impulse out of there. They're impulsing out. All right, let's head toward the search area. Yeah, let's head towards that search area. I'll lower torpedoes and shields so that we don't uh, get spotted. Guys, guys, this should literally be the last thing on our mission. Want me to keep shields up or lower them? Uh, go ahead and lower them for now. Oh, here. Yeah. Shields. Give me a little more engine if you could. Boop boop. Raise powered engines. Powered engines raised. Let's move quick. Anomalies are harm are harmful. Don't run into those. Go ahead and take some of the power from the phasers and move the shield just in case. Okay. Two notches. Two notches. On it. Let me know when you want me to raise shields. 30 km. Should be getting close. Our power to looks like it's at 25 percent. I want you. I want you to focus uh, on scanning at the second. The second you can scan. Search here. It says minimal, but it won't let me scan. So get closer. Torpedo control system. Restored. Excellent. Well done, engineer. Thank you. So not let me scan them. There we go. Now I can fire a probe. Probe has been fired. We are receiving data from the probe. Whew. This mission's been rough. I believe we have enough data, Captain. Let's warp to the Devon system. Set warp for Devon. Engineer, you know what Charging you coils! Coil Love it. Do you want me to raise shields for when we get there? R raise shields. Shields being raised. Nine seconds to shields. Warp coils charged. Ready for warp? Take us away. Let's hit it. Oh, wow. Out outside of the, uh, the ship warp looks cool. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we did we it! We do it! Oh, yes. Oh, Good my geez. God. You get a heart attack, Captain? <laughs> Dude, that was so <laughs> stressful. <laughs> Dude, that was intense. Whew.
Dude, man. When, like, literally when we got to the point where it was like, all right, they're just gonna fire upon us and we're just gonna go ahead and scan that and now, like, that's, that's, scan section. Yeah. I yeah. was like, this is straight out of a movie. Like, this is something Kirk <laughs> would do. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm going to call it a night, but good time. I think I'm, I think I'm going to do the same. That was pretty stressful. All right. Oh. See ya. All right. I'm doing this again tomorrow, though, by the way, both of y'all. So, Noted. All right. I'll get on, too. I don't have work, so I'll be on all day, probably. Nice. Guys, literally, that was, that was fucking <laughs> awesome. Y'all just made that so much more fun for me. Dude, that like, was no awesome. joke. Like, the, like, the stress level for me, like, my heart, like, is racing right now. Like, literally, when we're at that point where we have three Klingon ships around us, and it's like, fuck it, just gun it, let's go. Like, let's just scan that bitch and get out of here. <laughs> that was a beast. I was, like, I was like, oh, dude. Oh, man. We made it out of the, like, split second. Well, they were firing on us as we were impulsing. We were about to die, yeah. <laughs> oh, man, I deserve a medal. You do! <laughs> Alright. Yeah. Thank you, Joe, you're the man. Thank you. You have a medal in, in our hearts. <laughs> Alright. Alright, I think I'm gonna take a break now and like watch House of Cards and calm down. <laughs> good call, okay. good call. I probably will too. Alright, fellas. Thank Not you. Not a very problem. Much. See you later. No problem. See you later. Powering down. <laughs> Bye, See Joe. ya. And now. I'm going to try a random mission with the uh, original Enterprise. I'll just roll it solo. So I got to see what the original Enterprise is like. Other than, like, a hot mess. So let's see. Solo adventure. Uh, play with an AI crew. Start. Um... Hopefully that was the right thing to pick. Okay, good, 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 good. I guess I have to be the captain. I'm going to choose Ongoing Voyages, Original Enterprise, Recommended for Advanced Crews. Mission Recover Mission, Rescue Mission, Research Mission, All Missions. Nifty. Yeah, it'll just randomly generate a mission, which is good, because, let's be real here, a uh, real... Oh, jeez. Like, a real campaign is better than randomly generated missions, but a real campaign ends. So then, like, having a random mission generator is a very good call. Captain's Log Supplemental. Our communications with the research facility were abruptly cut off. We're on our way now to check on them. Okay. I will update our operational chart. Yay, we got original Trek uniforms. Nice. Nice. I think they look good on me. I think they look fantastic. Um, boy, do I need a help overlay. Grab, clip, oh, no. <laughs> Previous target, next target, show objectives. Rescue survivors, investigate research station. Okay, local map. Um, yeah, 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 they can go there. Oh, good, I have, that's where my red alert button is. Oh, let's see. Oh, man, this is a hot mess. Um, how do I switch to you? Okay, that's, uh, that's that. Take over. Assuming control. Okay. So, let's see. Help overlay. Phaser, oh, man. I'm gonna just toggle the shields. Fire phaser. I, I kind of like this interface more because it's a hot mess. And look at this. Look at this bullshit. This is, a, this is the local view. It's not even a TV screen. It's a piece of paper. Oh, man. You're a shield dampener. Oh, gee, that's our tactical data. Just It's just over there. Okay, okay. Um, what do I do? Okay, that brings me back to Captain. There it is. Take over. They should be engineers. This engineer, yes. Oh, no. Oh, no. Give me the... Oh. Let's see. Cancel warp coil. Charge warp coil. Cancel. Prepare. Uh, in oh, jeez. Oh, man. Oh, man. I like this so much more. 
I like this so much more because it makes it hard because the interface is horse shit. Why do I have a feeling that doesn't actually do anything? Is that what it looks like outside? Oh, wait, 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 wait. That is actually what it looks like outside. That is actually... Is that actually a functional view screen? Is that... Does... Okay, no, that that's the screensaver. That's the view screen. Okay, okay. Lock on target, energize, cancel, transport. What am I... What am I targeting? What am I, tar what am I targeting? I don't know what I'm targeting. Um, but... This is so cool. This is so cool. I like this one so much better. Tomorrow, I am going to suggest we play an original Trek mission. This is this is so much better. Okay. Exiting okay. Anomaly. Ensign Rao. So this is, this is how we control the ship. Um. Oh lord. Oh no. We have arrow keys. Oh man. Okay, you're not noticing this cuz you're not in VR. But on the other ship, the view screen was actually a window. You could see outside that it was 3D. Here, that is literally a TV. Like, it's flat. It is flat. It is a tiny little flat TV. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh jeez. I got I got oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I like this. This is such horse shit. It's beautiful. Uh collision warning. Good. We have a light for that. Current speed. Where's my speed? Increase speed. Okay, so we are going full speed ahead. Oh man. Oh man, this is so awful. This is so awful. Um, so I should actually like figure out what I'm doing. What are my objectives? Give me that clipboard. My objective button. Show objectives. <laughs> Rescue survivors from what? Investigate the research station. You know, I have a hail. Um, hey, there's a there's our third person view of the ship. alarm okay um um do we run into something because it felt like we ran into something no okay we all good we all good okay clipboard um rescue survivors from fucking what um balls There's no targets here. What are we rescuing? Hey, there's a captain's info field over there. Um. Oh, they even changed this. Nice, nice, beautiful. Um. Dan Fan is playing Street Fighter Five. Good on ya. Oh, jeez. Um. Hmm. Oh, we're gonna try this again. I'm gonna quit. And I'm going to listen to what they have to say. I'm going to try to complete a, a mission it, with the original Enterprise. But I need to hear what the heck my objective is. Because I, I, don't, I don't see 
where anyone is. By the way, in a patch, they're going to add in uh they're going to add in support for the Watson uh Microsoft Watson to do voice commands. So that way it's not just selecting from a menu, you can actually talk to your AI crew. So ongoing voyages, original enterprise. I'll be your captain, we'll fly till we're free. Find your place in time. Just follow me. Showing you wonders in space that you've never seen. We we'll take to the skies. We we'll take to the skies. We we'll take to the sky with me. No one knows. No one knows that song. It is as awful as I sang it. Log start at two two five eight point two three seven. The USS Suribachi has discovered significant Klingon activity and requested our support. We are en route now. Significant Klingon activity. Okay, objectives. Captain, we're being hailed. Putting it on the view screen. Enterprise, this is a Suribachi. Our ship is partially disabled and under heavy attack. We need immediate support. All right. Okay, give me the local map. Uh, you. Give me this. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. This is what I mean by it takes a lot of space. Can, it, can, I, can I touch that? Can I touch it? Oh, oh, no. Actually, I don't think I can. Someone give me the interface. Uh, where's targets? Current speed. Where is? I don't even know. Okay, so target that, and then tell you to target on scanning range. Okay, you you uh, approach target. Aye, aye, Captain. <laughs> it's so flat. It's such a tiny little flat TV compared to the big old screen. Oh man! Oh man, this is a trip! Who knew taking the 3D away would be so amazing? Like, it- it feels- it feels so old! Everything feels so beautifully old! You! Moment you can, scan that target. Yeah, I need to clean up the room and get a better setup for this. Tiny text. I wish I could actually move the clipboard. Science report. A network of antennas designed to allow real-time communication across interstellar distances. Dope. You! Analyze that target. Science report. Network of antennas designed to allow long distance blah de blah. What's up with that one though? Can we scan that? 
Just can't. Screw it. Uh, give me a warp map. Captain, we've reached our destination. Oh, Yenor is a place we can warp to. Why can't I... Why can't I select that one? Why can't I select the Yenora? That's where we need to go. It's weird. Okay, well. I guess I'm gonna... Uh, take you over. Actually, no. No. I'm gonna take over. Wait, no, I can just. You. Power to engines. Understood. Prioritizing power to engines. Take you over. And we're just gonna. Give me this. Oh, that's not what I need. Oh, uh, jeez, I need a screen. Oh, we could travel there by impulse. Okay. Where the hell are we? So, current location, you know, I'm trying stellar orbit. I don't see the Yonora on there. Yes. Oh wait, no, because the Yonora is where we are. I feel stupid. What's the name of the ship I'm rescuing again? Suribachi. There we go. Keith, Frezia, Aria, Orbit, Warp to the Keith system. That's pretty good. Okay, so. I am going to need a warp map. And then I need to go to the Keith system. And then I say... I understood. Initializing warp protocols. Diverting power. Warp course plotted. Lining up for warp vector. Ready for warp. Warp vector aligned. Course plotted. On your mark. Aye, aye. We're clear. Where am I? Oh, man. Enterprise, Stillwater. We're engaged with hostile forces and need backup. I have updated the star charts with new coordinates. Analyze that anomaly. Scanning. Scans complete. The anomaly is hazardous. Captain, be aware that the anomaly's effect on the ship will be substantial. Warning. Moving into the anomaly, it could cause direct damage to the ship. I will update your panel, Captain. Hi, Captain. Bring her to full stop. Aye, aye. Adjusting heading. No, avoid that. There we go. Grab that clipboard. Show objectives. It's about Aria orbit region. I bet we need impulse map. There it is. Okay, so next target. Hi. No, 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 no. Don't, 
Don't approach that target. Full stop, full stop. Full stop. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Um. There we go. I apparently didn't select it. Butterfingers. Aye, aye, Captain. Diverting power for impulse. Plotting impulse course. We're ready to go. Now oh, we're getting anomalied up in here. But it's all good. Engage! Neat. We're gonna need to murder some people, I bet. But we have to, uh, resolve the confrontation. I'm reading multiple hostile contacts. Murder them! Okay, let's see. Take over. Hostile vessel inbound. Oh no. What is this? was that? I don't know. Uh. Where's my scan anyway? Oh, scan target. Is that the Suribachi? Is that the thing we're trying to rescue? Am I trying to murder the thing we're trying to rescue? Transferring data to your panel, Captain. Okay, so that that is a space thing. Uh let's see. Weapons. The Suribachi is at 25% hull. It's out of range. You. Power to phases. Aye, aye. Maximizing power to phases. Suribachi hull integrity 10%. You know where the Suribachi is. There it is, Suribachi. Okay, so, uh, we need to... I understood. Follow no, no, set speed. Full speed. Aye, aye, Captain. Maximum throttle. And you... need to power to engines. Aye, full power to engines. Yeah, single player captaining is doable, but definitely uh, confusing. Wee, there's my rainbow spinny things. Nice. Nice. This is Captain Salbach. We are on our way to reinforce you. We're showing on their sensors. Well, balls. Uh, 
No, that's all I need to hear. Oh, jeez. Wait, 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 wait. This, this, that's a mine, that's a mine. Okay, you, 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 full stop. You. You, uh... Yeah, pew pew the mines. Pew pew the mines better, everyone. Man, you're bad at doing a full stop. And you, uh, power to phaser. Okay, what do I have that tells me how the hull is? Hull is at eighty-one percent. Shields are off max speed. Is that, um, let's see. Repair. Sign crew. Oh, whoa, what, what's that, 50? A warp core. Oh, man. Oh, man, this is a, I, I'm out of this job. You do it. Fix things. Repair systems. Captain, this is the Raleigh. We are on hand and engaging enemy forces. Need to set this up better. Okay, so. it look like out there? Where's them Klingons? There's them Klingons. Hi, Klingons. Oh, there's more Klingons. Please murder them faster, everyone! Ma'am? Taking over? You need to push buttons faster! The problem that we're not turned around, you, turn us around. There we go. There we go. There we go. You, repair the warp core. Well, I guess there's a fire up there. Beam him up, Scotty. Oh man, did you see the red shirt die? That was amazing! That was the best! Oh man, don't just. I don't even care about winning. All the red shirts need to die. <laughs> oh, there we go. Bonk. <laughs> yes! He just flipped over the banister. It was beautiful. Oh! Oh, that is what life is all about. Yeah, yeah, that went poorly. That went poorly. But, that was neat. That was very neat. Okay. Since the fun crew is gone, and I have already played a full mission and then lost horribly, and I don't know how this is even turning out before I start doing this for any longer... I think we're going to call it a night. Uh, thank you very much for showing up. Don't need to emote with glow sticks anymore. And yeah, I uh, hope you enjoyed our first gel trek of sorts. It has been quite a thing.
quite, quite a thing. All right. I'll stop this. Enjoy your close-up view of my gut. Thank you for watching.